Hi, and welcome to another episode of High Finance. Owners of Frozen Buds became the first to receive a state-approved marijuana retail license during a two-day meeting held by the Alaska Marijuana Control Board. Not far behind was Destiny and Nick Need's Fairbanks retail store, who received a round of applause from the audience as they won unanimous approval from the board. According to the Associated Press, the couple poured more than $150,000 into their business and plans to open shop by October 1st. Frozen Buds received approval to make a variety of treats including cannabis-infused truffles, cakes, brownies, and ice cream. Other businesses approved by the board are Einstein Labs for product manufacturing and Dream Green Farms for growing. Another meeting will be scheduled to continue this process. Pound Labs Incorporation developed a handheld device to measure the presence of THC by a simple breath test. Founded by an emergency room doctor, a patent attorney, and a reserve deputy sheriff, the device has successfully completed roadside field testing by local law enforcement. Hound Lab's device resembles an alcohol breathalyzer and is to be used in situations where officers suspect marijuana use. According to the cannabis, if drivers performed poorly in the field test, they were asked if they would voluntarily blow into the handheld device, which then relayed the results to a docking station for a chemical analysis. Drivers who failed the roadside test were not arrested, but were found a safe means home. American X announced that it has signed a mutual agreement with Blaze Now, a mobile app that serves enthusiasts to premium cannabis services and technology. American X is the industry's first fully operated electronic cannabis marketplace that gives cultivators, wholesale distributors, and retail vendors the option to buy, sell, or exchange inventories. Blaze Now uses a GPS platform to connect with dispensaries, delivery services, vape shops, and doctors in a particular area. This free app also encourages business owners to promote their products directly to potential consumers in their area. While commenting on the news, CEO of Blaze Now, Mark Glover, states, Our goal is to provide all dispensaries and businesses with a secure platform to reach and increase their customer base. This concludes another episode. Today's news was brought to you by Marijuanomics. Check out highfinancereport.com for the latest updates on cannabis business.